Hey everybody. <clears throat> so something else I want to talk about with that the, the Biden video I just recently shared with you guys today. <clears throat> um, in the little bit of time that I watched, it's only like a minute and a half. He talked about how they're spending tens of billions of dollars into climate change, and then within a few more seconds, he then added on. <clears throat> Yeah, and we're also going to be giving money um, to the three big car companies, Ford, Chrysler, and, and GM, or um, something like that. Uh, but it's like, it's just right there in that. Like, he's putting billions of dollars into helping counter climate change, yet they're also funding fucking companies that directly uh, contribute to climate change. So this is the hypocrisy and the insanity that we live in today. And it's like a real good president would fucking do the research and look at cars combustion engines fossil fuel engines themselves produce a lot of co2 which is producing more heat which is resulting in climate change so it's like you're talking about how you're doing things to help <clears throat> save or fight climate change but at the same time you're doing things to help perpetuate it so this is where you have fucking uh, an insane world that we live in and we have allowed this because we as ourselves as citizens as, as consumers have not done enough thorough research or if we have we haven't given a fuck enough to scratch our heads and be like hold on a second this 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 combustion the, the engines the fossil fuels all this is wrong like is there not an alternative way to go about making vehicles yes there is actually but people just like I don't know why this information is, I think a lot of it has to do with money. I feel people have been bought out or they've been terrorized out or pushed out, physically forced out of being able to share their good ideas. I mean, Tesla developed free energy almost a hundred years ago. Henry Ford had a car built out of hemp about a hundred years ago. Yeah, this information is, is, is hard to find. It's definitely not mainstream. And now we have a president talking about wanting to help out climate change, but he won't talk about hemp. And he's going to continue to help out these combustion fuel companies, which are continuing to fucking kill the planet. They're one in five people die from uh, CO2 related illnesses. So it's like we had, there's a huge issue with it. And yet, OK, we're going to spend billions to do it, but we're also going to spend money to continue to perpetuate it. It's like, why? Why continue to perpetuate a company, you know, is bad for the environment? Unless you have some type of nefarious design. Like, there's no good reason. Like, we have issues. They should stop. We should stop all chain. We should stop the way we're, we're making cars and focus on building a better vehicle that's better for everything all around instead of continuing to perpetuate and empower companies that ha are, are killing this whole planet and us along with it. So, it's just. Anyway. All right. Y'all take care. Bye.